inspiring story of a teenage inventor in Fairfield County, Connecticut, Connecticut, bringing comfort to children in the hospital. Ella Cassano has a rare disorder, and she was just 12 years old when she began making teddy bear covers for IVs to make them less intimidating for children. Well, the pandemic forced Ella to make some adjustments, but now five years later, her product is doing better than ever. How does news anchor Shirlene Alicott has her story. I was in my room and I took a stuffed penguin and I cut out the back and hot glued some mesh on. This was Ella Cassano in 2019, introducing her creation, the Medi Teddy, inspired by her own experience being treated for a chronic platelet disorder. She designed an adorable way to hide an IV bag, which can be intimidating to kids. During the pandemic, hospitals didn't really want to take plush products. So five years later, her invention has changed, but it's still thriving thriving and making a difference. This silicone version can be easily cleaned and used for many patients. This way the patient just sees the Meditati through the front instead of a bag of chemo or blood or medication. It can even sport a personal message, which then just, just wipes away. In all 50 U.S. states, 30 countries, we still get pictures and testimonials from parents, notes from them saying how much their patient loves their Meditati. Cassano is currently on a fundraising mission so she can provide the Medi Teddies to families for free. The project has taught this this recent high school graduate so much as she prepares for freshman year at Stanford University. It's just been cool for me to see like how the shipping works, how the orders come in, like getting our patents, trademarks, copyright, stuff like that. Despite all the upcoming changes, Cassano plans to continue to grow her venture, making a scary time for small patients just a little bit easier. I'm just happy to be able to continue to send Meditatis to patients who are going through so much. And um, I do hope that they just provide them some comfort, a little bit of a smile, things like that. Shirley Nalika, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.